Tonight's vital person is a Victoria artist who wanted to honor inspiring women in her community. And the beautiful portraits she's created do just that, but will also help vulnerable women in our community. Veronica Cooper explains. This is a portrait of Catherine Holt. She's the CEO of the Chamber of Commerce. And this portrait is one of nearly 40 that artist Alfreda Schragen has created. Uh, these women have done and contributed a great deal to society. So I thought, well, this would be a nice way to honor these women. And then uh, because I had worked with Our Place before, well, let's see if we can raise money with it. For Alfreda to come on board and say she wants to do something positive, celebrate amazing women in, in our community, and use this as, as a, a way of supporting Our Place, uh, it's, it's uh, spectacular. The women are Alfreda's second portrait series supporting Our Place. These are all family members. Uh, some have passed on, some haven't. When she painted these works in 2007, Elfrida was deeply moved as she talked with her portrait subjects. My whole sense of what the homeless world is was changed radically and people became people. Which is why she wanted to support our place once again. And because this portrait series is honoring women, funds raised will support a women's program at Next Steps. Next Steps is an initiative from Our Place Society. We've been here since October of 2017, and we have had more than 100 clients. It's a five-week program to help people facing barriers find work. The one thing that all of these people share is they've gone through some kind of trauma. And for women, unfortunately, most of that trauma comes from the hands of men. So to ask them to do something as vulnerable as coming into a room with a bunch of men to talk about why you're unemployed is a huge ask, and it's an unfair ask. And so Next Steps created a separate support program, Women in Progress. It's a series of workshops. The goal at the end is to find employment or meaningful volunteer work, but the route to get there is more female-centered. I'm very excited that part of this money is going back to programs for women. She's a very, very talented artist. It's a very heartfelt project and a good, good fundraiser for a good cause. So far we've actually been able to raise $30,000 with a goal of $40,000. We originally wanted to be able to show off the portraits at the Bay Centre, uh, but now it's more of a virtual event. So people can go to ourplacesociety.com, check out all the portraits, and they can either buy one outright or donate to one that they feel they have a connection to. I think that it's important that people understand that when they put money towards a person, it honors that person. And so if they go to the link, it all goes straight to our place anyways. But it's, it's an honor for the women. You can donate to Admired Portraits of Women Leaders in Our Community until June 30th at OurPlaceSociety.com. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.